Hey love bugs, it's Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome into my returning subs, my growing extended beautiful family. Just thank you for sharing your experiences with me throughout our shifts, um, knowing that things are coming forth for a reason and just paying attention to the signs is truly a blessing. So with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings love and light and many blessings are definitely coming your way and if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already please like and subscribe hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video also if you are comfortable enough please drop me a line or two I love a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video or you just up tell me about your empathic gift and how it impacted your life and hit you towards a positive direction also, if you feel like the video is just giving you good vibes or good information you would love to share with a loved one, family, or friend, or even a fellow empath that are going through uh, confusion and need, you know, going through some dark times that they need confirmation or validation towards their life path or even their soul purpose, please go ahead and share. And while you're at it, give me a thumbs up, like, and also share on your social media favorites wherever you see fit. Thank you once again for the love and support. It's so greatly appreciated. And I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my videos. And today... My, um, my, uh, what is it? My meditation music is called Shamaic Drumming Journey Meditation Powerful Spiritual Music with Pure Brain Waves Theta 6.3 Hertz. And I will post that link in the description box below. And today my video is about Twin Flame 101, When That Strawberry Moon uh, full moon has you grounded. It really did. I mean, yesterday, I'm, and I know my energy is like crazy. So if y'all see these lights flashing, it's because I don't know, it's just projecting off of me. And I just finished doing a prayer and it was very powerful. So, you know, I asked for a lot of uplifting energy and I just got it. So, uh, um, anyways, but it's just like I was reading the articles about the, you know, the forthcoming of the strawberry uh, full moon that has just occurred yesterday. Um, I was so tired. I said my daughter stayed the night and, you know, with her sleep habits, she slept in the bed with me and, you know, she's grown. I didn't get any sleep. So I was just like, you know, what, I'm so cranky and I didn't want to share that that vibe with y'all so it was just like I just stayed to myself and went ahead and you know just recharged myself that was something I really had to do but it was like if you felt a, a urge of irritability uh feeling like that you might come out your mouth and say something that you know was not so kind and you know all these things are coming forth for you to like see them for what they truly are and, you know, you're probably dealing with a lot of past issues that you, you know, if you've been really tussling with for the last few months or even, you know, since last year, they, this is the most powerful moon that was supposed to be placed on us this year. So it had you probably thinking about a lot of things. Um, a lot of people felt irritable. You know, they felt like, you know, they just didn't want to be bothered and stuff like that. I know I was like that yesterday. I was just venting and venting and venting. And I felt good about it because I was just like, I need to release this. I need to release it all because you don't need to carry all that stuff. You know, releasing to the universe because they had you want to be grounded. You had to be able to work on yourself. You know, you probably were in a lot of solitude yesterday or wanting to be in solitude. You know, some of us have those jobs to where we have to be around people, which is not really pleasant because it just seems like everybody's energy is clashing so if you know if you had to deal with that yesterday as well as today today is probably a different thing like you're finally seeing things for what they truly are and there goes that light again finally seeing things for what they truly are being able to you know come to terms with the things that are going on in your life being able to know that all these things are coming into play for what they truly are and it's okay you know it's really okay to be doing that but um just dealing with all these different things that are going on in life, you know, you have to be, especially if it's not something that's uh, positive or um, something that's forthcoming, you know, that might keep hinder you in that way. You have to be able to release it to the world, you know, we'll release it to the universe and being able to make peace with it in love and light. You have to, you know, there's a lot of things that occurs in our life where it can be stressful. You know, you're, you know, you're probably dealing with a certain chapter of your life. You're ready, so ready to turn that page. And trust and believe you're getting the signs that it's almost over because a lot of people are ending an emotional cycle. You know, you're tired of dealing with it. Trust me, I'm there too. You know, I'm just like, I'm so tired of seeing this. You know, I'm so tired of dealing with this. You know, I'm ready to be in that 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 better 
that better environment because it's too toxic for me. It's just like, you know, I always try to keep to myself, you know, if I can help somebody, I love doing that. I love to be able to keep myself busy. And that's what they said a lot yesterday, that you probably had to keep yourself really busy, you know, um, being able to work on something that is therapeutic for you, that is going to be positive for you. So, um, I hope you all had that rest. You got whatever you needed to do. I know a lot of people that I know that are like pagans or, uh, or, you know, Wiccans, they did, you know, the full moon spell of anything that they were trying to get out of their life or they're trying to enhance a lot of them did the sigil, uh, prayers and stuff that they were trying to bring forth towards their life. And you probably had some really crazy dreams last night as well. So, um, this message is going to be short cause I already got to have to, I already got to have to, I already have to do another, another video on this, but it was on a totally different level. So I don't want to go ahead and merge them both together because they wanted me to do these separate. So I hope this was able to, you know, uh, bring you some peace because I know a lot of people probably had that urge of irritability. <laughs> some things may, may not have been pleasant for you. Things have probably just worked your last nerve yesterday, or you felt like you were going to bully people. Like you, you know, you really had to say something to set them straight or whatever, but I hope you didn't do that. But you know, if you did, I hope you can be able to set, you know, you know, step away from it today. <laughs> so this is a very short message. So, you know, like, and subscribe. I hope everybody was able to have a blessed weekend and all that stuff. Um, I'm going to give a post notification shout out to Bree T Tree. Much love to you as well. I hope everybody is doing blessed and, you know, having a blessed week as well. And give me a thumbs up, like, and also share. Uh, let me know if you resonate with this video. It would be greatly appreciated or giving, giving me your feedback is truly appreciated. But send out as much love and light and positivity. Oh, my gosh, y'all, my, my energy is, like, really crazy right now. Give love and light out to, to anybody that truly needs it, especially everybody. Just just go ahead and send it out. Know that you are truly blessed, highly favored, and forever loved. And knowing there's always somebody out there praying for your better days. And I will see you on my next video. Much love. Peace. Be wild.